For many people, the comfort and familiarity of the traditional desktop telephone are non-negotiable. There is something reassuring about holding a handset to your ear, speaking into the mouthpiece, and sometimes even fumbling playfully with the coiled cord. Even so, current trends seem to indicate that the days of these traditional desk phones, even highly advanced voice over IP VoIP phones, are numbered. In this podcast, we examine the rise of soft phones and the decline of hard phones. We also explore the reasons for this trend and try to predict what you can expect in the coming years. First, let's discuss soft phone and hard phone terminology. The term soft phone is a portmanteau of software and telephone and has its origins in the early days of VoIP deployments in the late 1990s. Originally, it referred to a VoIP telephony endpoint in the form of software typically run on a desktop PC. Since then, the term has been extended to include apps on mobile devices and software-based VoIP endpoints that perform the role of a telephone. By extension, the term hard phone came into use much later to distinguish between soft phones and the purpose-built IP phones we see on desks in a typical office. Although the term is not used as extensively as that of its software-based counterpart, the word hard phone is still sometimes used to refer to these physical telephony devices. Today, virtually all modern telecom systems leverage VoIP as their fundamental method of voice transmission. Unified communications systems, we'll refer to as UC systems, can register both purpose-built IP desk phones and soft phones, which are typically installed as apps on smartphones, tablets, desktops, and laptops. At its Cisco Live event last year, Cisco predicted that 75% of employee workstations will not be equipped with desk phones in the future. This is a profound statement, especially when we recognize that this prediction only considers physical office workstations. It does not include the massive migration to soft phones that has already occurred for the mobile workforce those employees not tied to specific desks or physical locations. The prediction is that employees who work at permanently located physical desks will, over time, also prefer the benefits of software-based communications devices over physical VoIP telephones on the desktop. What is fueling the soft phone trend? Arguably, the single most influential factor driving this trend is the rise of UC systems. VoIP systems tend to mimic their even more traditional PBX telephony systems, delivering voice communications to telephony-based end devices. UC systems enrich this communication by adding additional services, including collaboration capabilities, remote meeting features, multi-feed video, AI enhancements, and integration with third-party applications. Software-based endpoints are much more flexible and powerful at leveraging the capabilities of UC systems. They can be updated easily with a simple download of the newest version, and they can take advantage of the device's integrated camera, microphone, screen, and other peripherals. In contrast, to compete with such flexibility, IP desk phones need to have their own built-in cameras and screens and be able to interface with additional peripherals to achieve the same level of immersion and functionality. Once procured, these phones remain in their initial configurations for the lifetime of each device, with upgrades and limited features made possible only with the installation of a newer firmware version. Beyond the rise of UC, other factors make the use of soft phones more attractive for modern businesses. These factors have been accelerating this trend in recent months and will continue to do so for the next few years. Increased mobility and remote work. Soft phones can be installed on mobile devices, allowing users to make and receive calls from anywhere with an internet connection. This benefits both mobile-only workers and hybrid workers. Cost-effectiveness. 
Soft phones often require less hardware investment because they are typically installed on existing devices. In fact, they are usually free of charge or extremely cheap and can easily be installed by the end user. Additionally, the cost of maintenance and administration is substantially lower for soft phones than desk phones physical hardware because they can be updated online. Scalability and flexibility. Soft phones offer greater scalability and flexibility for businesses. It's easier to add new users or adjust the functionality of the phone according to the changing needs of the business. This scalability is particularly beneficial for growing companies and those with fluctuating staffing levels. Advanced features and updates. Platforms that leverage soft phones often provide a wider range of features and are updated more frequently than those delivering service only to hard phones. Features like advanced call forwarding, voicemail to email, and integration with CRM systems enhance productivity and efficiency. In fact, at Enterprise Connect 2024, most UC systems platforms introduced AI features like Microsoft Copilot to integrate with their soft phones for advanced note taking and productivity. User preference and tech savviness. As the workforce becomes more tech savvy, employees often prefer using devices that they are familiar with, like smartphones, desktops, or laptops. The user interfaces of soft phones tend to be more intuitive and closely aligned with the user experiences of other modern applications. Environmental concerns. Soft phones are more environmentally friendly because they reduce the need for manufacturing, shipping, maintaining, and eventually disposing of physical phone hardware. This is increasingly important for businesses looking to reduce their environmental impacts. Network convergence. VoIP and UC are network services that rely exclusively on internet connectivity. If they have not already done so, the logical next step for businesses is to converge their voice and data networks. Soft phones facilitate this convergence, simplifying the network infrastructure and potentially reducing costs. So what is the future of the hard phone? Although this trend is becoming increasingly established in the business world, we don't expect the hard phone to completely disappear anytime soon. One reason, of course, is that some users will continue to prefer them, but there are also certain niche markets where hard phones will not and cannot be phased out. These include scenarios where the actual telephony device does not belong to a particular person, but is shared by multiple people or used by multiple users in turn or succession. Such scenarios include healthcare. Hard phones are used in hospital rooms, doctor's examination rooms, and nurses' offices where quick communication by multiple users is required. Hospitality. Hotels and resorts often use hard phones in guest rooms and service desks. These devices are typically integrated with the hotel's management system for billing and service requests. Warehouses, manufacturing, and industrial sectors. In environments with harsh conditions or rough environments, hard phones are typically used because they are more durable and can be used with gloves and are less likely to be damaged. Public spaces and transport hubs. Airports, train stations, and public buildings often have hard phones for emergency and public use. Hard phones in common areas, in office spaces, and other public spaces allow for accessible and quick interaction. In conclusion, the need for mobility, cost effectiveness, and seamless integration with UC platforms drives the shift towards soft phones. This trend reflects the changing work environment and the evolving preferences and requirements of modern businesses and their employees. While hard phones will still be used, especially in certain industries and for specific roles, they are increasingly being replaced by more flexible, scalable, and feature-rich soft phone solutions. <laughs>